All right, so in this problem, we are going to consider the formula 3t equals q plus 3. Now we're going to choose which of the following statements is true for this formula. So let's start off with a. We have here, for negative q values, t is less than 0, meaning that t will be negative. Now if we take the value, if we plug in a negative 1 for the value of q, q equals negative 1, let's see what happens. We have 3t equals negative 1 plus 3. So if we simplify, we have 3t equals negative 1 plus 3, which gives us a positive 2. And now if we isolate this t by dividing by 3 on both sides, we get t equals 2 thirds, which is not what the statement says because we don't get a negative value for t, meaning that we can disqualify option A. Now let's move on to B. For positive t values, q will be greater than 0. Now if we take the value of 1 and plug it in for t, we will get a negative value for q. And we'll see this by plugging in 1 for t, and we'll see what value we get for q. So we have 3, if we simplify 3 times 1, equals q plus 3. Now if we isolate this q, we'll subtract 3 on both sides, and we get that q equals 0, which is not a positive value, therefore b is incorrect. Now for answers c and d, we have to, we have to understand better what the difference between t and q or q and t is. Now it would be easier to understand the difference between q and t instead of t and q because there is a constant in front of the t. So let's first understand what t is, or what q is. q, if we isolate it, we have, I'm going to subtract 3 on both sides, and we have here 3t minus 3, and, that and, and that's the value of q. Now if we plug this value of q back into the difference between q and t, we have 3t minus 3, that was q, and now we have minus t, so if we, ex if we examine the difference between them, we have 2t minus 3. And this is not a constant difference, because we do have a variable here that changes depending on what the value of this variable is. So the difference is constantly changing and is not constant. So our answer will be D for this question.